Hello everyone and welcome again in a new video tutorial. Today guys I'm going to show you how you can back up your data or how can you save your data in an external support. So guys the best advice is to get an external hard disk with five with 500 gigabit um, or, or more if you would like especially for the people that got a lot of data on their computer and as soon as you, you plug your hard disk or your external USB you will need to go to control panel you go to search windows and you type control panel these guys work for people with Windows Vista, Windows 7, Windows 8 and Windows 10 so you type just control panel and you, you open the control panel and here guys you, you change the view from large icons or small icons to category and you click on system and here guys you go to backup and restore Windows 7 and here you click setup backup this operation of starting Windows backup can take just two to three minutes and then it will show you your hard disk this is my hard disk in which I want to save my data you can also guys save on a network if you have a server your own server somewhere but it will take much longer so I will just leave my hard disk and as you can see it's the recommended one and we click next uh, by the way guys if you are if you are planning to put an USB key this wouldn't work with a USB key which is below uh, 16 giga you, you need to have 16 giga and more and here you can either let Windows choose for you or you can do like I, like I do let me choose and you click next here guys if you have important data in a data file so you select all of these uh, backup data for newly created users my my library my channel library yes and here also you can include um, some if you have some partition which contain backup like I have here so you can also select it and here guys, here guys I will suggest you to leave include a system image of drive AFE system partition I will suggest you to do so because it will make an image system of your, com of your, of your computer and if later you have any problem it will be resolved through this system image so I will just click next and here guys I have changed I have a schedule every Sunday at 7 p.m. to do this so I will suggest to you to just to disable it so that you let it for yourself so that you are the person who can do it or let it up to you and here you check for last time all users all local data in the hard drive D and system image included and we will just click save settings and run backup and that will start running your backup and it should start making a copy of your system for you when it will finish a window will pop up and it will tell you that the operation was successful Thanks guys for watching. If you still need help or assistance, you can always contact us via Facebook, Twitter or, or Gmail or you can just leave a comment below and we'll reply to you. Thanks for watching and talk to you soon in a new video tutorial.